purchasing our remote pet training collar pet vet model PTS008. Let me show you what is inside the box. Remote transmitter with a wrist strap and the receiver, the collar that is made from nylon soft material that is safe for the neck of, of your dog and it's easy to adjust depends on the size of your dog. Contact points and securing pads, test light, batteries, that is standard batteries 1.5 watts and user manual. Let me show you how to operate this system. After 30 seconds of no operation, the remote will be, the screen will be switched off and after 5 minutes with no operation, it will be turned to sleep mode for power saving. Now to use it with the receiver, we should adjust these contact points. For this we use securing pads. and screwing contact points ok, that's ready now for use it we should sync the remote with the receiver for that we should press the middle button the channel button hold it until P letter appear. It appeared. And now turn on the receiver. Hold the on button until green light start to flash. Now it started. Okay, and now we should turn we should press these two buttons, level buttons together. And you see the green light stopped. So now it's ready, we should press again the middle button a few seconds, that letter P disappeared. Now it's ready to use. Let's try the vibration button. Yeah. Here you can increase and decrease the level. Let's try the lowest level. Okay, and the highest level, 16. If you hold this button for more than 10 seconds, it will be automatically switched off for 5 seconds. This is for safety of your dog. Now it's automatically switched on, so you should just release the button. Okay, let's try tone button. It has no level, so it is the same. And the shock button. For test it, we use light test. Hold it here with the contact points. And now we use the highest level. Yeah. It's the highest, let's try the lowest. Okay, lowest. You can see the light is much less. And it's the same for vibration. After 10 seconds, it's automatically switching on. Yeah, you see. Then just release the button. Okay, that's all. And for turn off the receiver. Just press this button for a few seconds. You can see the red light. When it's off, it means the receiver is switched off. First of all, we should insert batteries inside of the remote. 